was born and raised on, on the water and around mountains. I love this. I love this place. And as you look around Telluride, Colorado, it's hard not to. It's a town built on recreation, a place where everyone wants to be outdoors. It's a good start, sir. I mean, certainly we recommend another six or seven rods. John Duncan owns Telluride Outside, offering the ultimate in outdoor memory making, rafting, fly fishing, just to name a few. And he says after oh, yeah. being in business for more than 20 years, the appeal of outdoor activities hasn't changed. But something has. What has changed, though, is the amount of water falling from the sky. Aside from the drought, no let up in the number of people coming here for fun and farmers using the river for irrigation and other municipal and industrial uses. The river is taking a beating. Now it may look like there's plenty of snow, snow that will eventually melt and go into the river, but the locals here say it's simply not enough. It's not only affecting the wildlife like the trout that recreation companies like Telluride Outside fish for. Just as a goldfish will only grow, will grow, only grow, will grow in size corresponding to the size of its, of its goldfish bowl or its fish tank, uh, which is a pretty well-known fact, so too with trout. It's also affecting the city's cash flow. Typically, Telluride Outside ends its rafting season on August 1st. But in the past 14 years, in all of them, the company has only held out to that date twice. And so those communities can't count on the boaters buying gas, buying groceries, using their shuttle services. Colorado River Conservation Board member April Montgomery says, although there's an obvious problem, there are positive things going on. The board recently designed an improved water flow to help three species of fish that swim the waters of the San Miguel, one of the two rivers that feed the Colorado. They plan on doing the same for the other. <laughs> And Duncan says it's all about making sure everyone who wants the experience of the great outdoors gets that shot. The amount of water that we have has everything to do with our ability to do, to do the things that we love.